Hi, welcome to Inti.com. Inti.com is a job portal. If you're looking for a job, you can log on to Inti.com and you can post your resume with us. In this video, I'm going to explain you very simple Java integration, basic Java integration, how system dot out dot printer and works in Java. Inside the system class is the declaration of how that looks public static final print stream out and inside the print stream class is a declaration of println that has a method signature that looks like public void println system is a final class and cannot be inherited we have a final class here and there is a variable called out static okay which is marked as static out is a static member member field of a system class and is of type print stream its access specifiers are public final this gets instantiated during the startup and gets mapped with the standard output console of the host. The printer and prints the argument passed to the standard console and the new line. So from the system you have a static variable, okay, and this will be initialized whenever the class is loaded. And this m and how it has methods out in the sense print stream. This is a print stream class, okay. Print stream class has a lot of methods like print ln, print and write. So so from you will be calling the print ln method and from there print and write will be called okay this is how it works so from system we have a static field which is of type print stream and from print stream has a lot of methods like print ln and other methods so you are going to call print ln so system with a static field and static field of type print stream and print stream have a method called print ln you are directly calling it without creating any object and you are pausing whatever strings passed it will be uh, printed on the standard console okay this is how you should you can explain so this is how it looks like in the exact class if we go to java lang and if you see the system class it it will the variable will be looking like the static final print stream out if you go to the print stream class you can see the method called println okay hope this video is useful for your uh, java preparation Thank you and all the best for your interview. Thank you.